and welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Rise of Industry. And we're going strong on fabric. Holy cow, do we have a lot of stuff in the in the motion right now? There is a there's an amazing amount of stuff going on right now. Um, I've got all of the plastic and adhesive back up. It was a gas problem, not shipping enough gas, so I added a couple more gas producers over here. This this little gas little gas vein over here is getting getting a lot of attention all right uh, another thing I did I was looking here and the clothing store uh, we have work clothes that can be made out of uh, the the heavy fabric and some more leather and we had so much leather that I thought you know what let's just let's just go for it and now we're getting a little low on leather, believe it or not. Um, and instead of selling the have the work clothes here, because six hundred seventy-three thousand might sound like a lot, but each one of these takes two fabric and two more leather, and two fabric that's six hundred thousand right there. So you're you're not, and and then when you add in the leather. Uh, it, it's really not, you're looking at about 30, so another 60,000. So you're literally making $10,000 on that. That's not, you're $10,000 more than you would by selling the raw ingredients. So down here we have another clothes shop, and this one sells work clothes for 810,000, which, let's face it, is more. So I'm shipping them all down here and selling them which is why uh, we've got other things going on so the <clears throat> the uh, zeppelin here has got destinations for a lot of things there's the clothing right there uh let's go check on brandy make sure my big money maker is actually uh, doing what it's told all right so we got 21 extra bottles what are we doing on wine Oh, we're doing stellar on wine. Uh, why are we not shipping the bottles fast enough? One truck per day. Let's let's get those bottles moved. I think I did that one truck per day because I was sending brandy somewhere else. Uh, as far as bottles go, uh, those are coming from up here. Uh, how are we doing here? We got so much glass in production. I'm not sure. We don't. We don't really have any surplus glass. Why are there bottles in here, though? We need to send those bottles out. Please send them out. No other bottles are getting shipped anywhere. That's good. I could clear this hardware store of glass. And uh, let's go ahead and do that. So right now, bottles are all that we're caring about. Let's see if we have any buildup of glass. If we do, I can add some more bottle manufacturers, which means I can add some more brandy manufacturers and you know it's just cascades from there now we're gonna go up here and look at fibers fibers uh, let's see Do -do -do. Tech tree. no not tech tree seven no we're not gonna deal with all of that uh, recipe book uh, fibers used in heavy fabric and light fabric well we've got lots of heavy fabric in process what we do have a lot of in excess is cotton we have so much cotton that this farm actually shut down and it has 148 cotton sitting in it so yeah uh, uh, it's it's doing just fine so cotton is used in the car seat well that's that's actually something we need to make is the car seat so yeah let's go ahead let's go ahead and look at the car seat 
which is a carpentry thing, and it uses eight furniture bases and seven cotton. That's quite a lot of cotton uh, in 30 days. Um, we, we could do quite a few of these, and if we want to sell the parts in the meantime, we have a car parts shop over here, and lo and behold, they take a car seat. So if we really want to, we can uh, sell car seats until we get the final, you know, the final goods going. And look at all the little stores in here. I was hoping to find a, I was hoping a car parts store would, would open up in here, but eh. Beggars can't be choosers, right? Uh, okay, so the thing we're going to need a lot of are these furniture bases. And those things take... Uh, planks which is a lumber thing so yeah we're gonna we're gonna go heavy very heavy on the lumber uh, let's do some terraforming and uh, I think we're gonna go that way I might even be able to go one more out that way like that and yeah I kind of want to do these the you know start the car seat the car seats can go here and then the planks, and then the lumber, so it just sort of goes right into the woods. I think that's a good idea. And uh, let's start with a road. And just in case we want some more water. Wait, those are four wide, so... One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We're gonna go out like that, in, and in, down. For no particular reason other than Staying, staying above board here. Okay, so first things first, we need a lot of lumber. So let's get some lumber. And I'm not, I'm not even going to pay attention to ratios at this point because we just need tons and tons of lumber. So uh, we're going to do one, and then we're going to do. Let's do one. Two, three, four, five, like that. And of course, that's offset wrong. Four, five, like that. <clears throat> Let's see, lumber for seats. Uh, I want to leave I want to leave some trees up in here because you know if we clear all the trees the lumber urns aren't gonna actually function which is kind of a bad thing one two three four five something like that Okay, lumber for seats two. Now we need carpentry factory uh, drinks carpentry center. Uh, let's first put in a yeah the auto saves are getting a little brutal. Um, let's put in a warehouse. Let's do warehouse lumber okay uh, now carpentry center I want if we put one I'm gonna pause it what's uh wooden planks good planks one it requires six lumber and we're getting one lumber, we're getting basically, let's see, six lumber every 40 days. One of these every 40 days is getting us four. So again, it's one and a half lumber thingies, lumber gatherers per plank. Um, and so we got 10 of those so that's something like 
you know, six in a fraction, maybe? Some some fraction of six uh, planks that we can support on ten of those. Oh, let's uh, make sure. Planks one, wooden planks, good. So I'm going to go with six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, if we need more lumber, I can add more lumber. If we have more planks, I can add more planks. But the planks, again, we're getting three planks every 40 days, uh, which is kind of an odd ratio to have. Uh, and then these are used in the furniture base. So the furniture base is... 40 days yeah 40 days uses two and wooden planks we're getting three every 40 days so we're actually able to build more furniture base than we do have planks two planks every 40 days three planks every 40 days so for every two of these we're going to be able to make three of the other ones uh, so two of these is three. So that's three. That's six. We're gonna be able to make nine furniture bases And let's do that a little bit further away from the forest That would be good uh, Let's do one two three four one two three four right here So this line will be um, We're gonna do this and this is going to be small furniture base one. And this is going to be small furniture base, just like that. And this is, again, two planks every 40 days. <clears throat> so what did I say? Uh, three, six, nine of these we can support, ideally. Um, so... Small furniture base. So, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, <clears throat> that's a lot of furniture bases. Um, just, just because uh, I don't want to run out of wood, that would be bad. I'm gonna go back here a little ways, and we're gonna add some more wood production. Just because we've got almost two billion dollars, why not? Bingo. Just because I want to make sure the planks are ample, ample opportunities for planks. I don't want to run out of those because that's a lot of furniture bases to get going. All right, now the furniture base is good. Uh, we're going to need then the seats and we're going to go up here a little ways and we're going to plan on this. Okay, let's check our recipe book. Uh, we are beyond that. Let's go to seats. Seats use eight furniture bases every 30 days. Uh, and we're going to be able to make, let's see, it's two, four, that's basically 18 every 40 days. That is not very many seat manufacturers. That might be two seat manufacturers, literally two seat manufacturers. Eight, eight furniture bases, so that's 16, and we're going to be able to make like 18. And there's an ever so slight bonus. Oh, yeah, that's going to be brutal. Um, steel frames. While tempting, I don't have any steel production going yet. Um, 
All right. Plant. Are, are these guys done yet? 40 days to produce that. That's just brutal. Yeah, produces three. There you go. Get that wood. All my zeppelins flying overhead. So awesome. Okay, so the car seat situation, we're literally, literally like two of these is about all we can handle. So let's do carpentry center again. And this is going to be car seat. And this is going to be car seat one. And let's just double that up here. Now, are you in line? See, it's in range of that one. And it's in range of this one. So it should be able to pull uh, furniture bases from here and cotton from there. And uh, Bob's your uncle. We're good to go. Now, I have a feeling we're going to be ramping up production over here quite a bit. Uh, yeah, we're probably going to be ramping that up. Let's go look. As far as being able to sell car seats, we're looking at five, a, five every 15 days. That is, yeah, we'll be able to make, we'll be able to ramp this production up way more than what we've got already. All right, we've got furniture bases on the way. <clears throat> let's see, terraform, let's, uh, lots and lots of trees. <clears throat> so far out. Yeah, look at the range on this thing. Woo! Thing is huge. All right. All right, this thing is already going out to grab some furniture bases. The first couple are in. We should have already picked up all, yeah, the cotton is in already which got this one growing again, which is kind of amazing. <clears throat> but the number of, yeah, the number of these furniture bases that these things need is crazy. And as everything sort of comes in, we can see how, how our ratio is set. Um, we got ample amount of lumber that's fine planks planks are going full speed here Just had a bunch of planks get dropped off so furniture bases should should start going there we go a little much in one one setup and we only need two some of these really loaded with a lot of them because <clears throat> they got enough for like the current craft and then the next craft so not sure how this decides all right, there's a bunch of furniture bases going. We may get this thing started yet. <clears throat> I kind of want a Zeppelin field. Let's see, how big is that? One, two, three, four. That's all. One, two, three, four. Zep seats. And I want the destination to be Zep seats. Any like car related final product, I want to be able to manage logistically with 
separate it from you know the mass of of everything so we actually have a car seat in production at the moment furniture bases not doing so hot i might want to add oh there's wooden planks you got a lot of planks here over here guys come get them while they're hot or cool i don't know whichever one but our first seat is coming in slowly oh look at that our this guy is spitting out this guy wants some furniture bases nice and the long autosave. Okay. All right, more. All right, more car seats. Nice. A little bit more cotton. As soon as the craft starts, it'll drop the cotton and it'll go out and grab some more. So that's good. Come on, finish. I want to see what the car seats look like when they're done. Uh, there they are. Yay, look at that. They're car seats. All right. Literally five in each one. Really? We're going to do that? I mean, I'm all for distribution and stuff, but... So, we have one full car seat ready to go it's not a lot wow these are these are hurting uh, okay so I think I'm gonna need how much wood do we have uh, this takes six wood I'm gonna do one more because I, I mean six that's a lot of lumber no, we're not going to deliver. No. This is a lot of of a uh, lot of stuff to pay for without making any money on the top of that. So I'm definitely going to want to start selling some seats. I mean, yeah, I could just drive them all the way there. Home goods, clothing, hardware, car parts. You seven hundred eighty-nine thousand. What are the car parts down here? Seven hundred eleven. Oh, we could actually sell them locally for more, and we're not making that many. So yeah, I think I'll just uh, send them on their way. Um, let's link that up. Okay, so here, uh, car seats, that was tier two. End products, uh, tier one. Why am I not seeing the car seat? Um, there it is. Commercial Valley High car parts shop. And we only had one of them. But hey, that's $700,000 right there. So I'm all for that. We have two more in production. And we have enough in here for another another craft. So, yeah, that's going good. Just got to make sure all of this stuff is good to go as well. Let's check our lumber situation. We keep keep an eye on it. If it doesn't go down, then I'll add another planks. And if planks start building up, I'll add one more furniture base. And it's just sort of little bits at a time. Yeah, see, there's... 
12 furniture bases in here. Why are you guys not going to grab furniture bases? I'm not understanding this. Weird. Maybe it's because it just took a while for the trucks to get down there and pick them up. Or something? I don't, I'm kind of at a loss. Yeah, maybe. I mean, they are getting picked up. But ideally, you'd have enough in here for a little bit more. Can I get one more over here to craft? No! Come on, you're going to come over here, aren't you? Yes. Craft it up. Okay, so. Car parts. We have we have liftoff on our car parts, so yeah, that that's gonna help. That's gonna help pay for this entire monster of a of a factory system here, just to build these car seats. And then once, obviously, once we've got a car, we're ready to build some of the car parts. I can stop that. I can stop this. And have them some build up and then deliver them wherever they're needed. But that's going to have to do it for this episode. And I thank you for watching. And I will see you next time.